Hello everybody, you're for the to another episode of Let's Play Legend of Zelda Skyward Sword. So last time we started the dungeon, we completed the dungeon, and now we're gonna fight the mini boss, the, the boss of the t dungeon. So here we go. But first, I'm gonna save just in case. Save. Yes. I mean, because I might not die, but there's this possibility I might die too. Because this boss is, well, I guess you would say he's kind of hard, but not to the point where you can't defeat him. But this boss is also part of the demo as well, so here we go. So it's going to flip this around, and this is how you do it. Boom. Connect the right pattern. Boom. And that opens the door. It looks like it's an up down four. It's an upside down four. Upside down four. Me, my favorite boss. Me, my favorite guy in the Zelda series. Favorite villain in the Zelda series. This guy here. Look who it is. I thought the tornado I stared at would have tossed you and torn you apart. But here you are. Not in pieces. Not that your life or death had any consequences. It's just the girl that the girl that matters now. And I can sense her just beyond the here. Hit her here, just beyond this door. And yet, yes, yeah, but her majesty from her perch in the clouds, and now she's ours. Oh, well, listen to me being positively uncivil. Let me introduce myself. And the demon lord presides over this land. You look down you look down upon this world you call the surface. You may call me Kirian. The truth is, I very much prefer the enluge of my full title, Lord Yurhan. But I'm not fussy. So you have caused a tornado. Where is she? Did <laughs> you really destroy your sword, foolish boy? Well, I'm right. The girl should have fallen to our hands already. She was nearly ours when that lonesome son of the goddess snatched her away. You have an idea how that made me feel inside? <laughs> Furious! A rage sick with anger! This turning offense had left me with a little strong appropriate appetite for bloodshed. Oh, creepy! You're creepy, dude! Still, I hardly this hardly seem it's fair. Being my positive position, being my position, being in my position. To take all my anger out on you. Which is why I promise up in front, right uh, up front, not to murder you. No, I'll just be true to the inch of your life. Okay, so here we go, boss time! <laughs> Here we go, Demon Lord, gear him. So, you want to trick him a lot. Now, the first phase is pretty simple, you just have to make sure you trick him. Now, if you put hit your sword in the wrong angle, he'll stop, he'll grab your sword. If he grabs your sword, you will, um, he'll take it from you, and then you get a little comic. Actually, you know what, here, I'll let him take my sword so you can see what it is. Yeah, yeah. It's a long and tall graph in the Or not like novice now. There we go. 
There, then yeah, I just did that so you can see what he looks like. So you can see what, what he says. No! Turn the other way. Turn no, no. Damn it. I don't want to see target him. Shit. Okay. Yeah, let me Now he has his own sword. So this is the second phase. Now this phase is not that difficult. Ow. Okay. Ow. So if you take a long time, he will do damage to you, so... Oh, come on! I hit you at the right position. Damn it. Okay, this second here. Let me fix my weird mode here. There we go. Alright. Oh crap, I wasn't close enough. Alright. Oh, damn it. You gotta time the spin attack right just right, because if you time the spin attack just right, you can do damage to him easily. Jumpy. Yeah, nobody likes his low. There you go, boss defeated. Okay. Well, you have had more fights than I risked possibly for out of a possible out of a, such a soft boy. But don't clap for yourself, ye quite yet. That sword isn't of yours is the only reason you still live. I fear I spent too much t time spent spent far too long teasing and toying with you. That girl's presence has all has all but faded from this place, which means there's no reason to linger here. Goodbye, Sky Child. Run and play for now. Give away again now, and you're dead. <laughs> there we go. The first boss is defeated. You got a heart container in the Christmas Bible and you're also fully replenished. Alright, so there we go. We got one extra heart container. Now let's go and see if we can, if we can meet up with Zelda. Because, um, the gear of him said she faded, or the presence faded, but... We will see if, uh, that's true. Yeah, it looks like nothing for now, so, um, she's not here. Alright, so let's go ahead and... I don't know why I pulled my sword. Uh, let's just put that away. We don't need that. The spring! It's a nice place.
Master, I have a message written in the language of the gods of old. Allow me to translate it for you. From the edge of time, I guide you, the one chosen to carry out the goddess's mission. The spirit maiden who is descended from the clouds must travel to two sacred places to purify her body. You stand in one of these places, the sky view spring. The other is known as the earth spring. This is the second this, this second spring is hidden away deep within the earth scorched earth of Elvin. The spirit maiden, even mindful of the heavy task entrusted to her, has set out for the second sacred place. This is second sacred place. You got the ruby tablets. This weather service sounds so much of a. All right. Oh, there's still a little cut scene here. Master, I just translated the what would appear to be Zelda's purified herself in the waters of this spring. And calculate a 37 chance that she is a 97 percent chance that she's. Already right, set out to Elden, where another great spirit spring hits. Why well, I say 97% when she is gone? Because we can't, because we can't, if we haven't seen her yet, that means she's gone. <coughs> However, it is not clear what method of travel Zelda used to f move from from here to the next destination. My analysis suggests that you should take the tablet to the altar of, in Skyloft. Doing so will likely open a new column of light on the surface, allowing you to descend to another area and continue your search for Zelda. The bird statue is to, to, that transports you to back to the sky is, should be in front should be in, fr in the forest you previously passed through. I like how you don't have to walk back. I like how it just like teleports you. It seems it's nice actually so I have to walk all the way back to the beginning of the temple. Yeah, uh, yeah, okay, so let's save. I have to go ahead and put the ruby tablet in and then I'm gonna save the then I'm gonna end the episode off there. Because after that we're gonna be doing we're gonna be doing a couple side quests. So next video we'll be doing a couple side quests. So Hey, it's me, Queen. Did you find your girl? Uh not yet. Oh, that's too bad. Well, it sounds like at least you know where you need to search for her, to, 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 to search next to find her. Wee, that's something, right? <coughs> I'm so glad I finally been kind of busy. I finally, I've finally been reunited with all my fellow cake queens. Friends, it's all thanks to you. Cool, Wee! Well, him. Yeah, any luck? Hopefully you find the girl you've been searching for real soon. Corku! Take care, okay? Alright, I will do that, Keekly. Thank you for your concern. Alright, so let's go up to the sky and make and go ahead and put this ruby tablet in. And now I'm gonna end off the episode. Nope, I don't want no, I don't wanna say no. Save. No, no, wait, no. That's not what I wanna do. Damn it! I'm fucking up left and right now. Great. The sky. Yes. I need to position myself better. Maybe hopefully that might fix the problem. Or maybe I just do this and make my thing closer. That seems like a good idea. I stood in front of the camera, yes. You saw me stand in front of the camera, but oh well. Alright, so. Yes, I know. Master Link. We hit the guy's cube with a scabbard strike earlier. I was able to detect a, re a, result, a, a resulting energy reaction above the clouds. Yeah, yeah, whatever. Energy reaction. So, I advise you to investigate that the area around this location. 
Yeah, but basically what she's just saying is she has um, some information, but we are gonna have to we are gonna be working with that right now because we're just gonna do like a skyloft and just go ahead and put this uh, thing in. However, I'm gonna, I am gonna be starting a side quest. I'm gonna be st I mean I am gonna have be talking to the, the star the girls who start a side quest. So a side quest, unless there's a god statue, unless there's a god statue to save my game in this area. But I don't think so. Alright. Let's see. The quest won't start until after we put the ruby tablet in. But let's go ahead and do that now. It's just going to be a, side quest, a short side quest, though, because I do not know how to get all of the items you're supposed to get to complete that quest. So, yeah. I only know how to get a couple of them, so... Actually, I only know how to get 15 of them, so... But anyway, let's go ahead and put the ruby tablet in. Land of Elden. And that tablet looks really huge. The next one. No, they don't have a snow area in this game. They don't have a snow area in this game. I think that's interesting. They don't have it. Master, I confirm the location of the second opening in the clouds. Barrier. It is located in the skies to the northeast. This opening will allow you to access a new area on the surface. I suggest you fly there as soon as you complete your and the necessary preparations. Oh, good. Okay, no one cares. Anyway, um, yeah. So, that'll be it for this episode. Thank you all for watching this episode. Let's play The Legend of Zelda Skyward Sword. I'm going to go outside here so I can start this quest thing. Once I do, I will end off the episode. Because I'm going to gotta find a save point, so. Well, I'm already ending the episode off. Unless there's a guy statue out here, which I think there might be. Damn it, uh... Well, I don't. Uh, there's no. St there's no save point here. Oh, Clutely, where did you go? What will I do if she's been kidnapped? Oh, Link. A perfect timing. You haven't seen Clutely, have you? Nope. I. I see. Please, Link, won't you help me look for her? I've got... I've been looking everywhere, but I can't find her. I have asked everyone I could to find for help. And a few people have said she's been spotted with some unknown person with a scary face. Someone else said even... Someone else even said they thought they'd seen her carried off by a monster. A monster! She must have been kidnapped. She's so cute and friendly. Someone would have just walked up with would have just walked off with her. Find quickly, please, please. It breaks my heart to think that she's somewhere out there crying. Please, Link. Fine. Thank you. The Night Academy is sure should be proud of, to have a student like you. Please find my daughter quickly. But well, we won't be doing that until next episode. Thank you all for watching this episode. Let's play. Let us let us Skyward Sword. You know I said this once. Um, next time we will. Um, next time we will uh, go do the um, Kukli side quest as well as grabbing a couple extra chests, a couple pieces of heart, all that good jazz. So if you like this video, please give it a thumbs up. If you really like it, please consider subscribing to my channel. It really helps me out if you do, and make sure you leave, like, leave your positive or negative comments down below. It's 100 saying, getting 20% cooler, signing off, peace out.